Pyongyang's attempt to engage with Seoul is more than just a tactic. That's according to 38 North. The watchers of the regime from the U.S. based website point out the Army Kingdom's statement on Wednesday hints at it being serious about talks. Cha Sangmi has more on their analysis. U.S. based North Korea monitoring website 38 North said on Wednesday that Pyongyang's attempt to restore South North dialogue is a lot more than just a tactic. The analysis comes after Pyongyang announced on Wednesday its intention to open an inter-Korean communication channel. Robert Carlin, former chief of the Northeast Asia Division at the U.S. State Department's Bureau of Intelligence and Research, wrote that Pyongyang's so-called initiative to potentially reopen South-North dialogue is about more than just attempting to draw us all away from Washington. Carlin gave nine reasons why Pyongyang's move is a serious one. He first talked about the messenger of the statement, who wasn't just a spokesman, but the chairman of North Korea's Committee for Peaceful Reunification, which Carlin suggested added weight to the message. Moreover, that the announcement was delivered upon authorization of Kim Jong-un shows that the leader has publicly authorized the statement. Carlin also pinpoints how Pyongyang addressed South Korean President Moon Jae-in by his full name and proper title which he added is a clear sign of respect. Furthermore, casting a positive light on President Moon's instructions, the North demonstrated a willingness to not just respect but deal with him. Carlin also points out how statement included Kim's personal response to President Moon. Kim's personal instructions to promptly carry out, quote, substantial measures with the South Korean authorities out of a sincere stand and honest attitude is another sign of opening up. And Kim mentioning the dispatch of a North Korean delegation to the 2018 PyeongChang Winter Olympics as the first meaningful and good step towards inter-Korean relations suggests there could be more. Carlin casts light on the overall positive vibe of the announcement, as well as the unusual proposal Kim Jong-un had made in his New Year's address. Cha Sang-mi, Arirang News.